Hello everyone and welcome to this week's edition of Environment Matters. I'm Mike Huff. Depending on which groundhog you believe, we either have more winter weather ahead or spring is just around the corner. Either way, backyard gardeners like me are browsing seed catalogs and looking forward to this summer's harvest. Our friends at the Sustainability Department of Marshall University hope, by planting time, to provide a little boost. Compost is a nutrient-rich mix of organic matter that plants love and gardeners value and Marshall University is about to start producing it on a commercial scale. It's a story we first told you about last year. We just received our digester that you see here behind me. Um, this was kind of the final piece that we needed to uh, be able to start the compost facility. But getting in here was a bit of a challenge. Then just as we placed the order, uh, COVID hit. So the, the digester is built in Canada, so you know, factories were shut down, it put us seven months behind, and then when it was ready to ship, we had a little delay at the border because nothing could come across. And when it finally arrived. Oh my gosh, I, I can't even put into words how excited I am. I've been working on this for over two years and um, to have it finally, uh, the last piece finally get here and, and um, to start working on the protocols and recipes for, for the compost is just so exciting. As a matter of fact, when it pulled in on the truck the day it was delivered, I was jumping up and down and screaming and everyone was laughing at me. <laughs> the composting facility will divert tons of university waste material, paper, cardboard, food scraps, and other organic materials from the landfill. The finished compost will be used for university landscaping and local school gardening projects and marketed to the public as herd dirt. If all goes well, they hope to have their first batch ready later this spring. For Environment Matters, I'm Mike Huff. Thanks for watching.